Hello, today we're going to show you how to use Google Authenticator to get instant MFA codes when logging into MyCGS. With Google Authenticator, DME suppliers no longer have to wait on email or text codes. First, we'll show you what it's like to log into MyCGS using Google Authenticator. Enter your user ID and password as usual. Click Submit. When Google Authenticator is set up in your account, this message will display. If you have the Google Authenticator mobile app, open it on your cell phone and enter the six-digit code displayed. If you have the Google Authenticator web browser extension, click on the icon and enter the six-digit code displayed. Within seconds, you're inside the portal. Now that you've seen how Google Authenticator works, we're going to walk through how to install it on your mobile phone or website browser. You can effectively install Google Authenticator through either of these options, but not both you must select mobile phone or web browser. First, we'll show you how it works with your cell phone. Go to the Apple App Store or Google Play Store and search Google Authenticator. Download the app. Next, log into your MyCGS account. Once in the portal, go to My Account and select Update MFA Options. You probably have Use Email and or Use Text selected, but we recommend that you keep those boxes checked. But now, scroll down and select the third box as well, which is titled Use Google Authenticator. Then press the button New Authentication Setup. A QR code will display on your screen. Follow the instructions on your Google Authenticator app to scan the QR code. You can also manually enter the code, but scanning is easier. After successfully scanning, press the Submit button. A message will ask you to confirm your Authenticator setup with the six-digit code. In that box, enter the six-digit code displayed on your app and press Submit. You're all set. Next time you log in, you can open your mobile app and enter the six-digit code for your MFA with zero wait time. Now we'll walk you through how to add Google Authenticator as a web browser extension. Make sure you're using Edge, Firefox, or Chrome. Go to the website authenticator.cc and click the blue Add To button. You'll be taken to one of three screens depending on your browser of choice. We'll use Chrome in this example. Follow the instructions and click the button that says Get or Add To. After completing these steps, log into MyCGS in the same browser. So if you downloaded the Chrome extension, log into the portal using Chrome. Go to My Account and select Update MFA Options. Select the check mark next to Use Google Authenticator and press the button New Authentication Setup. A QR code will display on your screen. Now it's time to use the extension. In the top right corner of your browser, there will be a small Google Authenticator icon. You may have to click on an Extensions icon to see the Google Authenticator icon. Click on the icon. Now you need to scan the QR code. Find the icon that indicates Scan. It may look like a square with a line through it. Click the Scan icon and then click and drag your cursor over the QR code. Then a message will pop up saying that your account has been added. Next, you must click the blue Submit button to save your preferences. Don't forget this step. Now a message will ask you to confirm your Authenticator setup with the six-digit code. Once again, click on the browser extension icon in the top right corner. You will see a six-digit code. Enter the code and click Submit. Congrats! Your MFA preferences are set up. Suppliers have described using Google Authenticator as simple, easy, fast, and convenient. We agree, and we hope that you enjoy this portal enhancement.